Yeah. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy the Gun Crow here to bring you back with another video. And before we get started with the um video, y'all already know you gotta hit the subscribe button. Leave a like, leave a comment down below. This is going to help you out real good. Um, today we're gonna be doing the defense, the defense video. How to defense? I did one like months ago when the prelude came out, but that was just my career stuff, I believe. But um, the only way to clamp up, bro, do not use the L2 stick. I'm gonna tell you right now. Only time you need to use the L2 step when they come closer to the paint. Well, when they get close to you, you that's when you force them. You force them to do something. Like, you may do like, force to get a turnover. They may lose the ball a bit. They're going to stumble. Like, you know, get them kind of scared. Like, put the pressure on them. It's all about putting the pressure on them. Um, what you want to do, if they, go to your, if they go to the left, go to the right, read, read their move. Use the um, L stick. Just to follow them. The L stick. If they go left, you go left. They go right, they go right. The moment when you see they about to shoot, do I launch this jump shot? You got to press the R stick up. See, when I was the center, um, I just spin the R stick up because like a post score has take over. I just I just do it right away. I just do it right away. I just do it, and he just gonna miss. Even though you guys take over, it works every time. I'm like I'm trying to tell you, it works every time. That's all you gotta do. Just flip the R stick up when they about to hit the shot, or when they fall away. No, watch this, just like this. When they fall away, you just do it like that. Look at that. They going to um, break. Sometimes they might go out unless they a pure shot shooter or something like that. That like the elite three. You gotta be prepared. You gotta be prepared. You gotta step up your game, bro. If you wanna win games and stuff, I might do a separate video. Uh, if you want me to, if you want like show you how to win, um, win tools every time. I know it's a lot of elite threes, and so sometimes maybe pros and stuff. But it's pros and amateur ones or something like that. Go against them, pros and amateur. They're elite threes. He got just got no life or something like that. But hey, they doing their thing. They grinding. But hey, I don't know if they take showers or not. But if they do, congratulations. Uh, um, I'm losing my voice. I'm sorry. But yeah, the basis of defense is just follow them. You know, put the pressure on them. If they're elites and stuff like that, you know, it's it's gonna be kind of a little tough. It's gonna be a little tough. So you know, don't sweat it. Like it's just gonna happen. It's it gonna be like that sometimes. It's, you gotta read the archetypes. I said read, but um, read archetypes. Look at, look at that. See, while well, spending on squares, sometimes you gotta do it at the right moment. Then you gotta go ball control. You got a good advantage because you gotta learn how to do it. Just tap it. If you gonna hold it, you gonna foul. So you gotta do it at the right moment. Sometimes it's gonna be a reach in. Most of the time, it's like a 50-50 chance. So you gotta be careful about your fouling and stuff like that. Just defense. Just put a point blank defense, or just press the triangle if you're a center or go to the paint. When anybody hit a layup or something, just press triangle, just flip the off stick up if you're a really, really big man. So, yeah, I get blocks every time. Because I had like five blocks. If you see my glass cleaning videos, you'll know what I'm talking about. Because you see me hit blocks easy. But, yeah, that's the really basics of how to defense. Bro. If you're not a defense, then that's the video for you. Or go check out the new video I had a couple of months ago, which I think I lied. I don't think I lied, but I didn't really know that much. So now, so I learned something new. You learn something new every day about this game, don't you? But um, yeah, all you gotta do is apply the pressure on them, and you know, get in business. <laughs> and make sure you got some good strength as well, too. Well, at least some strength. So just max out everything. I mean, of course, everybody max out everything. If you're a ninety or something to this point, of course you max out everything. Cause you try to get the cap breaker. So, um, your strength will be a point roll to this too, especially if you're a center. Make your center strong, real strong. Cause must go to a 91 so far. I don't know what my cap break is going to hit for the strength. So, yeah, it's going to be real easy, especially if you're a glad cleaner, if you're a post ball, if you're athletic. Any kind of center, pure reference to the pure lockdown, you good to go, bro. I swear, bro. It's going to be so easy. This for like the point guard, shot shooter, shot creators, ain't got no good defense with slashes. Point four, you know it all. So, um, with two ways. Well, not two ways, like defender, shot creator, whatever. Uh, it's still the video for you. It'll be making more dumb, especially when you got your badge, like defensive stopper, pit pocket, everything's gonna work out to play. I promise you. Just, you know, don't let it get to it. If they shoot a three or something like that, don't, don't lose your composure, bro. Because if you do, you're gonna lose the game. Like, stay calm, get back on defense, and you're good to go. Because that's what I did, and I'm beating Elite Three so easily. So, you know, I lost a close game, which I'm not really that mad because they sell. I'm used to it as an everyday thing, but I got to do my part. They got to do their part. So, trust your teammates. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Click the bell to be notified whenever I post new videos. And I'm going to catch you guys in the next one.